So, right now, uh, just about 50 minutes ago, uh, YouTube had another update to the, uh, uh, I guess you can call it the user interface. Uh, this one, so far, doesn't seem to be uh, that bad. Uh, it definitely looks more streamlined and... Uh, uh, a lot better at least than than the last few updates but the thing that that's just been bothering me is that there uh, there have been so many more updates uh over the last year than there had been uh in the last few years um that YouTube has been around like i i know that YouTube is oof, how many years old now um I think they should be eight or nine years old now, but uh, there's just been so many more updates uh, lately, and it's it's just it's kind of uh, difficult because you get used to uh, a specific update and then they change it again, and this one sort of just happened just out of the blue. Uh, what I can say is. I do like that when you are in the video, uh, like when you you click to watch a video, uh, you do get the um, menu bar on the side as a drop down option instead of that sort of um, side thing that would pop out because then it would move over uh, your video, like the the window that that the video was showing on would be sort of shifted over um, to accommodate uh, that bar on the side. This time around, you just click the button um, that shows the three lines um, that's right next to the YouTube logo, and you sort of get a drop-down uh, bar instead of a thing coming in from the side. Uh, also, they added a few more settings um, available right next to the uh, upload button, but this one kind of just seems redundant to me because if you just click on your, uh, on your YouTube uh, account name, at the top corner next to your uh, notification center there um, you get the exact same options there so what's that really for like I mean it, it's right next to it so the you can click the one button uh, the one button to get those options or you can click the next thing over to get the exact same options so I find that just to be a little bit redu uh, redundant um, Something else that kind of bothers me is that they put uh, on the sidebar, they have playlists um, above your subscriptions, and I personally would prefer that the subscriptions be above the playlists, because um, the playlists that they show are playlists that you either liked or playlists that you have made yourself, and I'd much rather just see... Uh, a list of my subscribers, um, uh, my subscriptions first, and then possibly a playlist uh, um, list on the side as well. Uh, all I can say really is that it it seems to be uh, a little bit better uh, moving towards um, a more sleek design, but it's still kind of bothersome. The, like um, one thing that I'm still not certain about is the change uh, in the in the layout of when you're watching a video inside of a playlist. Like, they have it now that when you're watching a video in a playlist, instead of the uh, banner that's at the top of the video, where it uh, gave you the options to either skip ahead to the next video um, or several other options there, uh, that bar there has been moved below the video uh, in its own box, and all the options are available there. And I don't know how to take that exactly because um, in the first point, uh, you can go ahead and uh, change settings and stuff uh, without it uh, encroaching on the space of the video itself. But then again, do they really need to move it down to its own separate box? Uh, I know that I'm just nitpicking here, but it, it, it's just it's bothersome that they uh constantly uh update youtube when it's not really that necessary we just need to have our videos there uh be able to watch them they they don't need to be constantly changing um stuff 
in the foreground. They don't need to change the way that the interface looks. What they need to change is possibly how the search function works exactly. Um, try to try to make it more, uh, I guess, direct. Because I find a lot of times when I'm searching for one thing, I just don't get that. Uh, like, say, if I'll search for a trailer for a movie, all I get is, um, like, a hundred videos showing, um, watch the full movie online, 1080p resolution, um, and then it's just a link to some other website. Uh, there just need, there needs to be a way where you can, um, like, they, they just need to alter the, the search engine function, and this is just a, a crazy idea because, like, I mean, YouTube is owned by Google. It's a Google product. They should have an amazing uh, search engine function um, installed in YouTube, but it just doesn't seem to work half the time. And it is kind of disappointing sometimes, but you just have to deal with it right now. Um, basically, I think the... the um, to simply put it, what I'm looking for in future YouTube updates is uh, something behind the scenes, um, an update to the uh, search uh, functionality, and just different stuff like that. Even even the suggestions on, on the sides need to be uh, more, uh, I guess, accurate to what it is that you're watching. And probably a way to, I guess, turn off some of these uh, recommended uh, channels and stuff like that. Because I don't want to be looking at that stuff all the time. Um, but yeah, I know that that's not exactly something that's in the background. That's that's right up front. That's in the in the uh, user interface there. Anyways, I know lots of people have been complaining about, about uh, YouTube um, and their updates over like the last year. Especially over these last few months. And I know that my opinion is sort of just drowned out and mixed in with everybody else's. And in the end, we're all just being little crybabies and we should just enjoy what we get because uh, we're not paying for it anyways. Um, so, like, I mean, just it it sucks. Sometimes it's, it's good. Sometimes it's bad. Uh... Just live with it. I mean, it's not. It's it's not anything really bad. It's just, it's just kind of, uh, I guess, uh, disappointing to get reacquainted with something and then have to do it yet again. Anyways, this whole video was just a big uh, rambling mess. Uh, so just if you want to see more stuff like this, or if you just want me to stick to movie reviews. Uh, technology reviews, video game uh, pickups, videos, that kind of stuff, just let me know in the comment section below. Uh, anything you want to say, just leave it there. Uh, comment suggestions, uh, any ideas, anything at all, just leave it in the comment section below, and I'll get back to you as soon as I possibly can. And that's it. See ya.